Igniting a New Paradigm of Open Source Ideas. One Community Weekly Progress Update, number 436. One Community is a 501c3 nonprofit organization. We are creating open source and free shared blueprints and resources, tools and tutorials, and do it yourself instructions for highest good living. Creating solution models that create additional solution creating models in the service of all life on this planet. My name is Gene Sable, and I'm the executive director of the One Community 501c3 nonprofit organization. One Community is bringing together people with the desire and the consciousness for the highest good of all life on this planet to build sustainable, regenerative, and self replicating teacher demonstration hubs as a pathway to global sustainability. This is our August 1st, 2021 edition of our weekly progress update. And today's topic is igniting a new paradigm of open source ideas, because this is what we're doing. We are igniting a new paradigm of open source ideas by creating all the tools, tutorials, resources, and do-it-yourself instructions for replicable and ultra-sustainable approaches to food, energy, housing, education, economics, fulfilled living practices, and true earth stewardship. Putting all this stuff together as teacher demonstration hubs that will teach other people how to create even more open source tools, tutorials, and resources, and to really create a new paradigm of open source ideas and sustainability that is mainstream accessible and easy enough, affordable enough, and demonstrates attractive enough so the idea will spread on its own. And so this is what we're doing. You know, we're working to create a comprehensively sustainable planet through igniting a new paradigm of open source ideas through making those ideas easy enough and accessible. And everything that you see in the background of the video here is what we're developing. Like this is the foundation of the teacher demonstration hub that one community will build, that people will be able to come and experience, and that people when they look around will see that everything that they see is open source and able to be replicated through the instructions, the development plans, the open source uh, engineering plans, and everything else, step-by-step -step instructionals for replicating it all. Everything from what you see growing to the complete housing infrastructure to natural swimming pools to eco hot tubs to the complete city center that includes those things and so much more, all of it. Open source, the education model, the fulfilled living and social architecture structure, all that stuff open source, live streamed in a lot of cases so people have access to free information during classes and things like that that we're running throughout the day. All this open source and free share to show people what is possible, what is possible when you're living this way. What is possible when you build on a foundation of radical sustainability and design it to be the most amazing place possible to live? And we are designing this to demonstrate that a, a way of living that we think that most people will consider to be far superior to the way that they're living right now. And that's our idea for igniting this new paradigm of open source ideas and for creating a self-replicating, we talk about a self-replicating model, that is the idea, is to demonstrate a way of living, a new paradigm that is so much better than the way that people are living right now, and to make access easy and affordable so that people will take that idea and run with it. You know, and to build a global cooperative and a global collaborative of eco-villages, eco-communities, eventually eco-cities working together to create even more open source tools, tutorials, and resources, and to provide this way of living to anybody that's interested in living this way. And to ultimately reach that tipping point of public participation so that we can positively impact the lives of everybody on this planet. And that may seem like just a mind-blowing concept, the idea that it's impossible, but the reality of it is, is, you know, with a self-replicating model... If, if you consider the idea that one community can inspire two more communities of just 50 people to start in the, our second year, and those three communities, us and those two communities working together, can inspire four more communities the year after that, and eight more the year after that, and 16 the year after that, 32 and 64, you know, that self-replicating idea could involve every single person on the planet within 30 years. Now, will it actually unfold that way? No, but the reality of it is, is we don't need it to unfold that way to positively impact the lives of everybody on this planet because we just need to reach the tipping point. You know, the reality is, is that if we had 5% buy-in on an idea like this, and it's not just the one community model, right? The idea is that one community is the starting point. It's the spark that ignites that new paradigm of open source ideas designed and open source and free shared so that human ingenuity can do the rest of the work. 
So human creativity and desire for whatever different people want with different values and different goals can look at the sustainability models and say, well, why don't we build it this way? Or I think this would be a better way to do that. Or, hey, that's a great thing to do, but you know, if we added this and we subtracted that, then that would be exactly what I want. And so through this open source foundation of new sustainability ideas, free shared with all the instructions and tutorials and resources necessary to know exactly how much is it gonna cost? How much time is it going to take to build? You know, what is the end result if you're to build it exactly the way that we are? How do you work with the county to get these things through, to get the permitting and things that you need? You know, where do you buy the equipment? You know, this is the stuff that we're researching and our all volunteer team is working out. We're answering these questions and we're open sourcing and free sharing it as we do so that other people will be able to take that information and replicate it and then take that information. And we talk about open source project launch blueprinting, which is not just open sourcing and saying, hey, this is open source, use it how you want, but open sourcing it so it's designed to be a foundation specifically for launching additional projects, evolutions, new iterations of what it is that we're creating so that people can modify it. So the open source ideas can be changed and evolved and grow into new and more interesting open source ideas and creating a larger global archive of information for people to draw from and building that foundation of sustainability as a pathway to global sustainability, to positively impacting the lives of everybody and everything on this planet by demonstrating a sustainable civilization. And so there might be other ways to do this, but this is the best way that we've come up with for creating this. And um, yeah, this is what we're investing all of our time in. I said, you know, we're a 100% volunteer organization. We've had over 600 volunteers now to this point contribute to our project over the last decade. We think we've got a couple more years of development before we're ready to completely start construction. And um, yeah, anybody who wants to participate who has skills to contribute to our action list, contact us. You know, that information is on our website where you can see exactly what our action list is that we're working on and um, apply through our collaboration page and uh, let us know what skills you have and get involved or just continue to follow our progress. Like every, just watching the video to the end actually helps our algorithm and supports us. So if every time one of these comes out, you just hit play and let that play in the background, maybe while you're doing something else, that helps us out. You know, other than that, follow us on social media, you know, check out our written blog if you'd like to see the specifics of what our all volunteer team has accomplished just in the last week, you know, and um, thanks. You know, every little bit helps. So your positive intent, your positive thoughts, your support of our project in whatever way works best for you is wonderful. And of course, if you want to donate, because we're 100% volunteer team, 100% uh, of donations go directly into our open source creation process, supporting our web infrastructure, evolving all of that, things like that. None of that goes to salaries for me or anybody else. Like I said, we're a 100% volunteer organization, uh, nonprofit organization, non-governmental organization, creating this because we want to live this way and it's because we want to create some a, a path for other people, anyone who wants to live this way to be able to do so as well. So this is what One Community is up to. This is what we're doing. And um, yeah, thanks for watching until the end. Of course, as I say every week, until next week, we will keep on keeping on. Thanks for following our progress. The One Community approach to highest good housing is eco-artistic home building that is affordable, sustainable, do-it-yourself duplicable, resource and space efficient, and consists of seven different sustainably constructed village models. One community is also creating an open source duplicable city center. It is designed to be LEED Platinum certified, provide 12 guest rooms, dining for over 150 people, and laundry and recreation space for over 300 people, all while saving money, time, space, and resources. One community's approach to highest good food is duplicable almost anywhere, scalable for different needs, more biodiverse and nutritious, part of forwarding a global open source botanical garden collaborative, and includes nine different free shared and duplicable growing environments. The next component is highest good education. This component is complete and pretty much ready to launch once we're on the property. One community's approach to highest good education is designed for all age groups, adaptable to any schooling environment, inspiring and fun for all participants, includes national standards, all subjects, lesson plans, teaching strategies, learning strategies and tools, classroom design, and more. 
The One Community Approach to Highest Good Society is globally focused, individually enriching, cooperative and collaborative, includes a highest good network and application, four different economic models, and combines fulfilled living and true earth stewardship for the benefit of all people and all life on this planet.